another springtime in the Rockies. I called up to see if I could make a citizen's arrest on the telephone. There were about a thousand people I wanted to arrest that day. The answer was no dice. Then I called up to see if I could get arrested on the telephone <laughs> for demonstrating against the CIA because I didn't have the time to go down to get printed and mugged. The answer was no way. <laughs> How's that for freedom? And what does it say about our highly touted communication system? <laughs> Why do they tell us what they tell us? Since all of the stats are quoted as saying rape, mutilation, and murder, and violent seduction of every kind are carried on against you overwhelmingly by close friends, mere friends, and relatives. Saying no to strangers should be revised to saying, hello, get me out of here. <laughs> Philippine phenomenology. If you can figure out how an ecclesiastical came by the name of Cardinal Sin, <laughs> and so forth. Got the devil in my soul, and I'm full of bad blues. I'm out here for trouble. I've got the black mountain blue. It's when uh, Charles Olson uh, closed it down. Ed Dorn reminds me of Voltaire as a gunslinger, a drifter, a wanderer. He comes into town, clocks the place, and moves on out. His poetry is particularly fresh as he is, and he meets things head on in his poetry. He was telling me about Black Mountain, how they all starved together there. It was radically democratic, he said. And uh, uh, very often exhilarating. And really, uh, I mean, it was like rushing before the hounds of learning. It was uh, threatening a bit. Uh, kept you awake. Wait till the Christians hear about this. In his effort to get prayer into the schools, President Reagan uh, reminded us that the ancient Romans and Greeks fell when they abandoned their gods. Students didn't pray exactly. For instance, they might think for a while before school starts. <laughs> If he means that, <laughs> thought could get the biggest boost it's had for centuries. <laughs> Maybe they could think about some Greek myths. And what about sacrifices? Maybe they could think about the Aztecs. I wouldn't mind seeing Cap Weinberger on a spit. <laughs> <laughs> and I wouldn't mind at all seeing Gene Kirkpatrick's frosty heart raised to the heathen skies. <laughs> Dorn is like a gorilla of literature. I asked him if he knew where his work was going, and he said his work is going no place. He said, I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. If it is a tunnel, I can see the light, but actually, it's a locomotive. Well, I, you know, I have been told, actually, in fact, it's a growing idea that uh, an able-bodied person otherwise in possession of their faculties really shouldn't uh, do such a childish thing as write poetry. <laughs> it's hard to uh, ignore that argument. That's why I don't think I write poetry. Uh, and increasingly I make statements. And, uh, I mean, you know, if they have the ring of poetry, that's all right, I don't mind. And people can call it poetry if they want. But it's not the way I think about it. Inspection. Poetry is now mostly government product. Therefore, we can dispense with the critical apparatus, and the grades assigned to beef will do nicely. <laughs> Prime, choice, good, commercial, canners, utility.
A lot of people, if you don't write, you know, imagistically or descriptively, uh, then people say to you, well, what, are you writing politically? And, uh, and I can't answer that because I think, uh, you know, just to wake up in the morning is political as far as I'm concerned. Uh, this is called While You're At It. As long as you're closing that window of vulnerability, would you mind shutting the door of paranoia? <laughs> and while you're at it, would you mind sweeping the carpet of disdain? And then there's the container of trash to carry out. When you're finished with that, you might go to the kitchen where you'll find the skillet of rashness. Uh, just throw in a few slices of the bacon of compatibility and fry well. And here's a kind of a follow-up on that one. It's called The Ladder of Opportunity. I thought metaphor had experienced its extremes with the window of vulnerability. But now we have the ladder of opportunity. So let's have a close look at those rungs, sawed about three quarters of the way through and filled with wood putty. What's, what, what's happening now is um, a really nasty trend toward uh, the use of language as an end in itself uh, and, uh, you know, the, the, uh, the, the blocking out or screening off of, uh, or the, you know, invalidation of the necessity to say something with it. Uh, and uh, saying something, uh, which is to talk about content, real content, uh, is uh, made more and more unfashionable by this uh, trend, which is uh, engineered, I think, by a lot of people who are embarrassed in the face of saying something because they've been so intimidated uh, in regard to saying anything that uh, they just as soon let it drop. I think really people who write in, in, incomprehensible language, uh, I, I, I think it's good mm -hmm. because it keeps them diverted mm -hmm. and, 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 it, and it actually sort of slots them into low-grade jobs and, and, and so forth and it's, uh, it's all right actually. It's, 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 in fact, it's better. Mm -hmm. It's better because they, would, they really get in the way otherwise. But I mean, if they're preoccupied with their machines and the net and so forth, that mm -hmm. really takes an awful lot of pressure off. I don't think they'd be a nuisance to the public anyway, because they don't actually have the power to do that. But it does keep them, well, like we used to say, it keeps them off the street. Yeah. So it's really as simple as that. There, this is how, this is how the, 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 the uh, NASDAQ sound. Telephonus interruptus. Breakfastest interrupt us. <laughs> men, 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 you men. Oh, what is this? Uh, <laughs> well, you can't read those either. I mean, they go like this. <laughs> so, <laughs> men, you meniscus. Lunch check. Up check. Dump it. Eerie theory. Up an eighth. Dreary theory. Up a quarter. Leary theory. Up a half. Query theory. Up a quarter. Dump it. Quick. Speed. Speed of thought down a fifth. Helmholtz up in eight. Um, <laughs> signal conduction modest, 50 meters per second. Brain process limit through vo uh, velocity. Get used to it. <laughs> Mechanical malfunction rising. M metal down one and three quarters. Dimmer dinner. <laughs> Stalk by celery. Sell by midnight. <laughs> malfunction up a third. Eerie theory rising. Nuts on a roll. Goodyear condom overhead. Crowd steady. <laughs> Ambient zol zolpidin. Tartrate down and somnolent. Fish eye shot, crowd down three quarters, hip flask hint, hippodrome, hip drone, more drone than hip. <laughs> uh, message on overhead, condom, circuit, st circum stadium. Uh, there once was a killer in LA who tried to make phone ends pay. The customer said, fuck it, we're not going to suck it. We ain't going to pay, no way. 900 numbers down a dime. Talk is cheap, but still no takers. Perfect crime worthless, like Italian bonds after the fall of Mussolini. Pound, i.e. Ezra, takes a bath. J 
gender fascism up 90 percent, investment up in pogrom for Euro-American Euro males, academic Marxist study, entrenched pricing, rep repression of the market uh, in standard works, NASDAQ plunges, literature forced into bankruptcy, burgers of theory replace samurais of literature, market value of new issue nil, sell it. Fear and, lo fear and loafing up a nickel. <laughs> Wi widen the runway, goofball steady, tax shelter quotation, intimidation by wielding the deity long term, buy, gros chien up, wheat meal, from. Pig hocks, glut the market, get out, body piercing up a quarter, bacteria count, sharp incline, virus burst steady, holy virgin up a nickel, Francesca de Rim Rimini, down forever, fear and loafing, up a peso. <laughs> Less than minus zero of nothing. Self-flagellation on the rise. Guilt and self-recrimination of one and a quarter. Guilt up an edge. Abuse up sharply. Excuse up, excuse up three quarters. Get rid of it. Nail the boss to the cross. Confess and then accuse. Trash it. Junk it. Sell it. Pump it or jump it or dump it, but don't hump it. <laughs> Inflection on the rise, long doc, long, long split, uh, sadic dividend, our, our mother's cathedral devils in stone, obscene carvings in, in the misere st stalls, holy ghost revelations merger announced. Devilets buggering, going, going, up, up, down, up, down, downtown. Optimi optimism big as a hyena's clit. <laughs> uh, Do you mind closing the door of paranoia? Would you close the door of paranoia? How about slamming the door of paranoia? <laughs>